God is love. Those words were in large metal letters on the right-hand side of the first church that I remember attending as a child. I can't remember what was on the left wall, but I believe it was a quote by Mary Baker Eddy. I left Christian Science some years later, but held on to that three-letter phrase, God is love, throughout my faith journey. So just a very short backstory of my life. At age five, I began piano and progressed very quickly. By age 11, I was playing hymns on the piano in Sunday school every week. Band and chorus filled my life in high school. I attended Hartwick College from 1975 to 77, as my organ teacher was a professor there. Through her, I met Ray Paradise, the then director of music ministries here and became acquainted with FUMC Oneonta. He opened a new world to me, for which I am ever grateful. For anyone who knew Ray, he proved that God is love. Amen. I decided because of him in this church to become a church musician. For everything, there is a season and a time, a time to love. So here are my seasons of love. Being a church musician is more than a job, it is a vocation, a life of service. I have been able to re-gift my knowledge and talents in many ways. And to me, that is an expression of love. Amen. A former choir boy of mine is now an organist and directs a multi-generational choir in an Episcopal church, which has gone on tour in England. I never thought that I would be so influential in a child's life that would eventually move him into church music to follow in the footsteps of someone who inspired you positively is an expression of love. I've spent years encouraging others to participate in church music programs, people who never thought they could be successful at it. They stuck with it and were faithful members of the groups. And people finding that joy is an expression of love. Returning to Oneonta to serve this congregation was my dream way back in 1977. Church music departments are fluid, and they change with times. <clears throat> we had a large handbell program encompassing all groups, then COVID hit. And that changed everything for every church. Some choir programs just cease to be, but not here. We learned a new way to do things, a new technology, and yes, it was quite time consuming, but we took on the challenge and with extra duties. Choir members who were unsure it would work soon found out how well it did work. We couldn't have in-person rehearsals, so we learned parts at home using sound files that I put up on the cloud, which I still do today. Keeping things seemingly normal for our congregation is an expression of love. As an organist, I'm in high demand. I've been able to serve other churches in our area by substituting during my vacations, providing services for weddings, funerals, and currently contracted out by St. Mary's for Saturday Masses and a few special Masses during the year. And just about every Saturday, someone comes and offers their appreciation for getting music back into their congregation, an expression of love. I expect no kudos. I do what I feel, what I've been called to do, even when it goes above and beyond other duties as required. And I guess that's my expression of love, by giving more than what's actually expected. So expressions of love, are they're all over the place, and you don't have to look for it. Sometimes it just happens when you least expect it. We are called to reflect on those three words that I began, say it with me, God is love. Say it like you mean it, God is love. Music will always be a part of my life and I usually have music rolling around in my head every few minutes. And if I broke it down, my seasons of love has been with me for 34,689,600 minutes. Now it's kind of difficult to sing a song with that number.
o'clock, it's 525,600 minutes multiplied by 66 years. You know it, sing along. Twenty-five thousand six hundred minutes, five hundred twenty-five thousand moments, oh dear, five hundred twenty-five thousand six hundred minutes. How do you measure, measure a year? In daylights, in sunsets, in midnights, in cups of coffee, in inches, in miles, and laughter and strife. Five hundred twenty-five thousand six hundred minutes. How?